Hello everybody, good morning. I wanted to thank everybody again for last week Wednesday when we had our special event Beyond Moving Teens Forward. We had a lot of fun um, and I think we had some really great speakers. If you missed it, you missed a really powerful day. Uh, I've seen a lot of quotes and a lot of students filled out surveys kind of telling us what they need. So we're going to make some changes in the next few weeks. Uh, a lot of it's kind of dealing with how we interact with one another because I think based on what everyone said in the session, we need to work on that skill as Washington High School. So we will. The other thing I want to touch on is when William Hollis spoke, he talked and he asked about people who had had suicidal thoughts at all. And we want to make sure that if you are any of those people who raise hands and you need any help, that you know places where you can go. Let your teacher know, let an administrator know, let a counselor know, we want to help you, we will guide you, and we will support you. That's our number one goal. So please, please let us know. Um, if anybody is hurting, it really does take all of us to make sure that we are all feeling safe at school. Thank you. Great weekend for Washington Music. Congratulations to the following All-Staters. In Orchestra, Vivian Shanley, Emma Prostein, Lillian Tapp, Josephine Norris, Leroy Carnes, Jalen Peterson, Franco Labella, Seth Moore, Travell Wright, Lee Prostein, Nicholas Werder, and alternate Alton Bauer. In choir, all state, Kennedy Felland, Lindsay DeWolf, Aaron Marner, Rachel German, Blair Johnson, Sophie Linwall, Olivia Parsons, Lucio O'Donnell, Sophia Burke, Ian Wolverton Weiss, Nathan Schmidt, Richard Locke, Ethan Dix, Patrick McDermott, Andrew Paoli, Jeffrey Abraham, Max Loker, and alternate Lars Anderslan. Congratulations, Allstate Choir. And in band, Megan Bennett, Kaylee Herr, Nick Ryan, Joe Jonason, and alternate Savannah Franklin. So congratulations to all of our Allstate performers and our music directors for an outstanding weekend. And remember, it's always a great day to be a warrior. Good morning, Washington High School. Today is Monday, October 28th. It is an B day, and welcome to your morning announcements. A uh, reminder to students uh, that you are not allowed to have food delivered by anyone during school hours. It will be turned away. Uh, there will be study table this week on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday from 3 to 4 p.m. in room 133. Seniors, there will be an important meeting on November 4th at 9.30 a.m. in the Little Theater to obtain information about ordering your cap and gown for graduation. Please plan to attend. It is that time of year for the annual Scouting for Food event. This year's event is scheduled for Saturday, November 9th at the Rockwell Collins C Avenue campus. We will be in building 134 again this year. We will have two shifts again this year, one from 8.30 a.m. to 11 a.m. and one from 10.30 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. We provide food and refreshments for the volunteer workers. We try to have everyone out of the building by 1.30 p.m. or earlier uh, that day at the last, as the last food that the scouts collect and drop off at building 134 is usually on or before noon. If you are interested in volunteering, please stop into the main office to sign up for a shift. There will be a meeting today. Uh, or, I'm sorry, there will be a meeting tomorrow, Tuesday, October 29th, for all those interested in wrestling for the season. Meet in Coach Graham's room after school in room 156. Fellowship of Christian Athletes, FCA, will be meeting Tuesday, October 29th during iLearning in room 128. All students are welcome. Search for Buyers-FCA meeting on FlexiSchedge and sign up to come. If you are interested interested in the art club field trip to the CR Museum of Arts on November 7th, please stop into room 237 to get a permission slip from Mrs. Ennis. And college visits that are coming up tomorrow, Northwestern University from Evanston will be in the counseling 
I'm sorry, I meant to say on Wednesday. Ignore that, on Wednesday. Northwestern University from Evanston will be in the counseling office at 1 p.m. On October 30th, the University of Wisconsin Platteville will be in the counseling office at 11 a.m. And on November 1st, St. Olaf's uh, College will be in the counseling office at 8 a.m. This week is Red Ribbon Week. Tomorrow is our red out, so everybody please wear red. I'm going to tell you guys a little bit more about Red Ribbon Week. It started to honor the sacrifice of Special Agent Enrique Kiki Camarena, who in 1985 was brutally murdered by drug traffickers in Mexico. Um, his hometown in California, um, to honor his sacrifice, had everybody wear red ribbons in opposition to drug violence. So please, everybody wear red tomorrow to honor the sacrifice and to spread awareness about and against drug violence. Thanks, guys. There are no events today, but happy birthday to Antoine Grisby, Anna Sejka Amig, Mark Seggers, Jessica Klein, Ayla Dawson, Alex Lopez Pastor, Anna Newman, and Ty Trin. If you see any of those warriors out in the hallway, please wish them a very happy birthday. And remember, it's always a great day to be a warrior.